All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Let's Play Earthbound with Destiny Insane. I know I sound fairly nasally. I'm still kind of sick, but I figured a few days is enough. I'm feeling well enough. Let's just get back into it. So in the last episode, we talked to Paula's dad who tried to chase us. We rescued Paula, and now we need to talk to this guy who gives us money. Ten thousand dollars. What's sad is this ten thousand dollars seems like it's a lot, but it's really not. Because you can get a lot more than ten thousand dollars. Anyway, we are shoot, what are we doing? Well I realized I completely forgot to show off these characters the last time I was in Tucson. I never talked to these two. Yeah. Yet they act as though I've spoken to them before. Don't ask. It just happens. <laughs> oh, and I forgot about this guy. We've dealt with him before. Just take the picture. Let me be on my way. Please. Please. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Fuzzy Pickles! Click. I've never seen any camera take a picture like that before. Oh. I don't remember if we can talk to this person first or if we have to wait until the show. I think we can pay out, pay them off now. Oh, nope. Nope. <laughs> this guy really knows how to infest. I'll handle my money after the show. You're just in time to see the show! Who cares? Now, I could waste my time talking to all of these people, but I'm not going to. Oh, wait. I have to. I have to talk to you. I could pose as your sister. Mrs. Brunette. She's not. And we just use, the, use this immediately. For everyone's amusement. I don't see how you could go in debt playing at a theater. I just don't. Get out of my way. Nope, we're not going to pay attention because this show is not for children. Yeah, three of them is enough. Everyone left! Why four? Yeah, that's right. Tonight you got the Chaos Theater soul men coming at ya. Rockin' and rollin' live on the sheer stage for a limited time only. The world's greatest blues men, the Runaway Five, and here they come. Oh yeah, baby! I swear I am sick. Now unfortunately, there's no way to skip through this. You have to watch the entire thing. Also, little oversight here. They're the runaway they're the runaway five, but there's six of them. Answer that, Nintendo. Yeah, bet you, you can't. Ain't got no money. Need help from kids. Ain't got no money. Need help from kids. Mixing real bad. I'm making these up. Don't know where this is going. That sucks real bad. I can't run at the time of a hat. <laughs> I don't know where I was going with that. And then the lights come back on, and bam, everyone's back. Okay, cool. Did I really just make an impromptu song while sick? What is wrong with me? Okay, can you please move out of my way? No, 
now we can go talk to this guy and be all like, hey buddy. And this doesn't happen. Hey buddy. Yay! We saved the Runaway Five! Now, a few episodes ago, I think I showed what happens if you take the regular bus to try and get to three. I'm not sure if I did, I don't remember. Oh, also, that's the only time that you get to see the Runaway Five. The Runaway Five Tour Bus. But this doesn't make sense to me. Oh, right, you actually have to get on the bus. Hey, sidewalk, get out of my way! I apologize for the sniffles. Yeah, this, isn't, this doesn't make sense to me. The music seems about as loud as the bus, like the normal bus, except for right there. <laughs> And yet, apparently, it's loud enough that ghosts won't bother the bus. Who knew that ghosts were bothered by loud music, anyway? And as you'll notice, I missed a present. What's in that present? I think it's like a bomb. And random house with no door to get into it. And random guy standing at the tunnel. Okay, so, here's the ghosts. Now, when I was younger, I actually thought that those pink spots on the ghost's head was a ribbon, in that the little space underneath was an eye, and the hand that's sticking further out, I thought that was a nose. So I thought that those were the weirdest ghosts, because they had freaking ribbons in their on, on their heads. Also, welcome to Threed. <laughs> yes, leave me in a zombie-infested town. Did I say zombies? I did not mean any such thing. There's no way that Threed could be infested with zombies. Play a little garbage in the trash can. Well, the good news is, we can upgrade our equipment! Yeah, see, I, I already have a quarter... A, a little over a quarter of what they needed. I could have honestly saved up enough money myself. Oh, shoot! <laughs> yes, sell. Do you still have a croissant? You d Sell the skip sandwich. And you! Sell your travel charm. You no longer need that. Okay. Now, I can give that to Ness. Ooh. Now, honestly, the thick fry pan you don't need to buy for Paula, it doesn't really affect her that much. But, it's still nice to have. <coughs> Excuse me. And I honestly thought that I would need more money than what I just spent. You don't even need... 700 yeah, you don't even need $700. Let's upgrade the equipment of these two, because her ribbon is better than a hard hat! Don't ask. What do you have? A toothbrush. Okay! So that just happened. Okay, let's actually free up some of your inventory space. Just a little bit. Alright. Now, first things first. You're new. What do you do? Don't talk too loud. I got what you need. A toy air gun. Bottle rockets? Will come in very handy a little bit later. Welcome to the circus! I assume there's supposed to be animals in there. Otherwise, that's just sad. How can we defeat the zombies? Oh, so there are zombies. <laughs> the zombies are on the move! Okay. 
Zombies. <laughs> now is it one of these two that you talk to? Nope. Well, I'm certain that we won't run into any of these zombies. Oh, God, flies! <laughs> this is bad. This is very, very bad. Well, let's take out the flies first. I hope I don't have to show off what happens when someone drops. That would be very bad. One! Two! Three. Oh, Paula, you defend. Because I don't need you wasting more psychic power. Uh. Ow. Take it out, miss. There we go. That's how you do. Yikes. Okay, neither of them are an actual trash can. There is an actual trash can. There it is. <laughs> Insecticide spray. Also fairly useless. Err. He stares into your soul. He looks you over. Okay, good for you guys. Let's just go ahead and... Okay, good. Good, we made it through. And... Let's talk to this guy first to get some... Oh! Jesus! Yeah, we're not dealing with them. Nope. Okay, you can actually be quick enough with this person to talk to her, and nothing happens. Let's call Dad. I have a feeling we're going to need to save. Continue! You never think it's good to work too hard. Seriously, Nintendo. This... There's someone in here, right? Yep. Especially near the graveyard. <laughs> Wise words to live by. This also lets you catch her here. This is not the right room. Open the door. Turn around. Open the door. Open... Oh, no. This is bad. This is bad. Oh, oh, you're losing consciousness. What could be the fate of Ness and his friend? Just say Paula! Ness and Paula! Nope, they're dead. Just kidding. Cool. Cool. Uh. Oh no, Paula's going on a seance. I'm calling our friend who we've never met. Jeff! And. Scene change. God, the music for this game is just so amazing. I love it. Most of the Super Nintendo games that I played have great music. And then the 64 came out. And I can count on, like... Well, probably both hands. The number of games that I thought had really good music. I am Paula, and I am with another friend. We are trying to contact you. If you hear me, please wake up and head south! Okay. <laughs> okay. So I guess now we're playing as Jeff. He has two dollars. He's at level one. This is going to be fun. But regardless, I think this is a good stopping point. So my name's Destiny Insane. Thank you for watching. Sorry about the sniffles. Sorry that I haven't updated. Again, I've been sick since Saturday evening. 
I just felt like maybe it was finally time to start recording again. So, thank you once again for watching, and I will see you whenever I post next. I don't know when that's going to be. Later! Ugh! <laughs>